Okay, Assalamualaikum dan uh, salam sejahtera. Okay, so we're going to continue with um, our tutorial. Okay, so kali ni kita akan uh, add up on the small things lah. Okay, the small necessary things. So if you follow the tutorial, okay, so this is what you will have okay, at the moment. Okay, I hope it's the uh, quite the same lah. Tak semestinya exactly because uh, there were some uh, students yang ada masalah pada uh, tangga kan. Okay, so it's okay. So we're just going to continue on. Okay, so now hari ni uh, what I'm going to do in this tutorial adalah I want to add some gutters on the roof and also uh, to show you how to change the uh, color of your roof ataupun to change the materials lah. Okay, jadi first of all what you have to do adalah kita kena tengok bumbung kita ni. Okay, I just realized that my bumbung ni kalau I tengok daripada sini uh, dia sama rata. Okay, dia tak ada overhang kat sini kan. Usually, bumbung dia akan ada overhang kan. Jadi, bila air hujan turun, so it's gonna, not gonna hit the walls directly lah. Okay, so I have to make some overhang lah dekat my walls ni. Eh, dekat, sorry, dekat my roof ni. Okay, so what I'm gonna do adalah I'm gonna panjangkan sikit this roof. Okay, so untuk panjangkan roof, okay, kita click on your roof, your item. Then, you're gonna go to your edit footprint. Okay, click your edit footprint. Then it will show you the outline lah. So meaning the pink outline, it means you can modify it. Okay, jadi dia tak sesuai kan kalau dekat sini. So we're gonna go to the roof level. So this is the roof level. Okay, the one yang kita nak panjangkan adalah this one. Okay, so I'm just like gonna move it je lah eh. I'm just gonna move it without any measurement eh. I'm just gonna move it a little bit. Maybe just make it like this lah. Okay. If it's too long ke? A bit shorter. Wait, kita zoom lebih sikit. Make it shorter a bit. Okay. So, I'm just gonna let it be like that. Okay, I'm gonna hit the right click. The green one ni. The lines are too short. It's okay. You can just delete the element. Then, kita akan tengok at the 3D model. Okay. So, now I already have my overhang. Okay. Jadi, kalau you tengok daripada from the front elevation macam ni. So, you dah ada overhang a little bit. Okay. Untuk nak add gutters. Okay. Gutters ni adalah the the what you call it? Yang benda untuk tampung air hujan tu eh. So, when the air hujan falls down, dia akan masuk ke gutter dan dia akan pergi ke down drain, down pipe. Kan? So, we're gonna Add on the gutters here. So, untuk add on gutters. Okay. So, kita akan go to roof. Okay. Architecture. Then, you go to roof. Then, you're gonna see uh, roof gutter. Okay. So, gonna click roof gutter. Okay. Then, you akan tengok dekat bawah ni. The arahan. Click on the edge of the roof. Atau sopit atau fascia of the model line. To add. Then, click. Okay. So, I want my gutter to be here. So, saya akan click sini. Okay, then when you do it like that, automatically you akan nampak, okay, you akan nampak you punya gutter. So, your gutter is here, kan? Okay, so saying that my gutter ni dia warna hijau. Okay, then what am I supposed to do if I want to change the color? Okay, salah satu cara you can do adalah you click the gutter, okay, then you go to edit type. So, your properties, okay, kalau if you still, uh, ni, your properties, everything you want to edit on the items ke apa, you have to go to your properties. Okay, then you edit type. Okay, then here, you can see the other categories, material semua. Tapi, so this is the original gutter. Okay, so whenever you want to modify something ke, nak add on ke, nak tukar color ke, whatever, you kena duplicate. Okay, sebab kita tak nak ganggu the original, uh, the original one. So, you click on duplicate. Okay. So, you just going to put it uh, gutter 2. Pun boleh. Okay. So, I'm going to click okay. So, automatically, saya akan rename. Okay. Rename dah rename. But, still, the gutter is going to be green. Dia akan follow the roof tadi tu kan. So, kita nak tukar the material. You go by the category. Okay. Then, the three dots ni. Kita tekan. Lambat sikit. So, this is where you can change your uh, colors lah. Okay, of the gutter 
Alright. So let's say uh, the color yang I nak tu tak ada dekat sini. Okay. When you see it, sometimes ada, sometimes tak ada. Sebab uh, it depends on you using it before. Okay. So let's say I don't have it here. Contoh, if I have it here, kan. If I just click uh, parking stripe color kuning ni lah. So it's going to be kuning kan. Okay. So now I want to change it to, um, let's say I want to change it to grey lah eh. Warna kelabu. Okay. So I'm going to go uh, make a new material. Okay, new material meaning like a, it's like a new color for the material lah. So, I'm going to create, uh, I'm going to click on this one. Kan yang bulatan ni dengan uh, the plus sign ni. I'm going to click this and I'm going to create new material. Okay. Bila dah create new material, so dia akan ada berada di sini. Okay, default new material. So, I'm going to click like sebelah dia ni. Okay. Bila saya click, dia akan uh, it open an asset browser. Okay, so here you have your asset browser. Okay, so bila you tengok sini, dia memang ada color-color lain. Tapi in meaning when it has the um, measurement 1.5 inch, kan? Jadi, dia, dia macam bentuk tiles lah. We don't want that one. We just want to change the paint of it. Okay, so I'm going to go here. Kita akan tekan cari paint. Okay, so bila saya cari paint, then I'm going to see here some of the colors. Kan? Tapi ni tak keluar colour dia. Tapi it's the colour lah. Memang adalah kat situ. But if you want to look at it. Uh, like. To see the colour. So you just go to wall paint pun boleh. Okay. So dekat wall paint. You akan ada bermacam-macam colour here. Okay. So let's say. For the gutter tu. Saya nak dia colour. Ada tak colour. Dark grey. Okay. So I have my dark grey. You boleh. You can see it here. It's locked. Okay. To unlock it. You just go here. And just uh, press the arrow sign. Okay. Automatically, it's going to be here. Dekat dia punya appearance. Okay. Tunggu kejap. It's updating. So, nanti bila dia dah berada di appearance. Okay. So, meaning this is the color grey. So, you have to go to your graphics pula. Okay. Your graphics pun, you have to check yang ni eh. Use render appearance. Contohnya, if you don't check it, dia akan ikut color original juga. So, you have to check it. Meaning, dia akan follow color appearance ni. So, if this is your color, you go to graphic, it's going to be your color too. Then, for your identity, it's going to be same here. Default new material. So, here you just going to put grey paint. Okay. Bila dah puas hati semua, you can apply. Then, you tekan OK. Right. Then, kita tekan OK. So, now we are using gutter number 2 lah. Okay, so bila kita tekan, automatically, gutter kita dah bertukar warna. Okay, so that is how you, one way of changing an item. The color of an item. Okay, Revit ni sebenarnya, dia ada pelbagai cara sebenarnya. Okay, dia ada macam-macam cara lah. At least ada dua tiga cara macam mana you want to change the paint ke apa so you have to explore lah but this is one the one that yang commonly that I use yang mudah lah but to me it is quite easier for me to change any colors yeah, using that uh, cara just now alright so we have um, tambah overhang a little bit then kita dah ada our gutters okay so this is a short video on the roof itself Okay, so I'm going to stop here. So we're going to meet at the next lesson. Right. Thank you.